Every year, about 100 million people travel out of Britain. The vast majority have their passports and travel documents looked at, but not everyone. Comprehensive exit checks were phased out in the 1990s in favour of an intelligence-led approach. But over the past decade, officials have been working on restoring exit controls, mainly by using information provided in advance of travel. The Home Office says it's developing and testing a new departure list system. It aims to have full exit controls in place by April. But the Home Affairs Committee says it shares the serious doubts of transport companies that the system will be ready in time. The committee says the new system must work efficiently, otherwise there'll be passenger queues and delays. It claims that would have a serious negative impact on business, trade and tourism. The MPs are also concerned delays at ports are a security risk by making it easier for illegal migrants to climb onto vehicles heading towards Britain. If the infrastructure does not work, then lorries are backed off a number of miles before they get into the ferry port. That gives the opportunity for illegal migrants to be able to jump on those lorries 